Chapter 5 Greenland the land of ice Ice and I of the total water available on the earth only about 3.54% is fresh water which we can use of this about 68.7% water is stored in the form of ice on the poles and high mountains this water keeps melting and we get it through rivers. Thus, ice is very important for our life as it is a major source of fresh water. Of the three climatic zones, the frigid zone is the coldest and the earth because of the sunlight being very slanting. This zone is located within the two circles around the poles, so it is also called the polar region. Many parts of the region are permanently covered with ice. The northern parts of Europe, Asia and North America are located in the North Frigid Zone. Greenland, the largest island in the world, is also located here. Antarctica is located in the South Frigid Zone, but it is dry, icy, windy and cold. So no one other than a few scientists and tourists live there. In this lesson, we shall study Greenland. Greenland Location Greenland is located in the continent of North America and is the third largest territory country in North America. It is located very close to the North Pole at a distance of just about 650 kilometers. It is an autonomous province of Denmark. Greenland is only 16 kilometers from Canada. Its total area is about 21,75,600 square kilometer. Cape Morris Jessup, the northernmost point of land in the world, is located in this island. Greenland is divided into five municipalities. It does not have an independent seat at the United Nations, UN. Know it. Greenland was so named by a Viking explorer Eric the Red in about 891 AD. Know it. It was an iceberg that the well-known ship, the Titanic, crashed into and sank. Relief features. Greenland, the largest island in the world, is mostly plain, but its coastal areas have many low mountains. The highest point in Greenland is Gunnbjörnfjeld which is about 12,139 feet high. About four-fifth area of Greenland is permanently covered with ice. The thick sheet of ice is known as ice cap. The average thickness of the ice cap on this island is 1.6 kilometer, while the thickest ice cap has been found to be 3.2 kilometer thick. The thick sheet of ice is very heavy, so its large pieces often break off and slide into the sea. These pieces are called icebergs. Only a small tip of an iceberg is visible above water. The remaining part remains underwater. They are very dangerous for the ships. Climate Greenland experiences extreme cold throughout the year. The average temperature is below the freezing point. It can be as low as minus 47 degrees Celsius in the winter months. During the winter months, the sun is mostly invisible here, so there is complete dark for many days. During the summer months, the sun shines for many days together, bringing some relief from cold. Even in summer, it is far colder than what is North India during the winter. Climate change is affecting the thick ice sheet here, which is melting faster than before. If ice melts, the sea level will rise, drowning many coastal areas in the world. Natural Vegetation In Greenland, everything is covered in ice during the winter and no vegetation grows here. So, there are no forests or trees. In summer, when there is a little relief from cold, some mosses, lichens, shrubs and grasses grow here. Besides, some colourful flowers, blueberries and cranberries can also be spotted here. Wildlife 
Despite lack of natural vegetation, Greenland is gifted with some unique wildlife. Many fur-bearing animals are found here which can withstand extreme cold. The important species of wildlife are wolf, reindeer, polar bear, musk ox, arctic fox, hare, wolverine and lemming. A wolf-like dog called husky is also found here. Water animals and birds are found in Greenland. Seal, whale, walrus, etc. are found in the cold water below the ice. Birds like duck, goose, wader, hua and loon are found here. During summer, several birds migrate to this place for nesting and feeding, making this place very fascinating. Greenland has the world's largest national park which is located most northerly. Its name is the North East Greenland National Park. It is larger than several countries of the world. Lifestyle. The population of Greenland is very sparse, only a little above 56,000. The Eskimos, also called Inuit, are the original inhabitants of Greenland. They have adapted themselves to the harsh climatic conditions well. They live in the northwest part of the island. Most of them have now merged with the Europeans and are called Greenlanders. They are short and strong and have a yellowish-brown skin. They have high cheekbones and narrow black eyes. Living in groups, they lead a primitive life. Their clothes are made from animal skins, which are common for all men, women and children. They wear a hooded jacket called parka with a pair of double trousers and high boots. They love to decorate their clothes with beads, fur and animal parts like toenails. The winter season is the challenging time for the Eskimos. They display their art of building igloos. An igloo is made of blocks of ice cemented together with snow. Presently, they also build their houses using stone, wood and animal skin. They use whale rib bones and grass to make the roof. Such houses are known as sod houses. In summer, the Eskimos live in skin tents called tau pigs. Fishing and hunting are the chief occupations of the Eskimos. They are expert hunters who hunt whales, musk oxen, walruses and polar bears. To hunt a seal, they dig a hole in the ice and wait nearby for a seal to come around. A harpoon is their main hunting weapon. It is a spear with a rope attached to it. Now, rifles have mostly replaced harpoons. People speak Greenlandic and Danish. Most people can speak both languages. There is a tradition of singing and art in Greenland. Some popular music bands are also working there. The popular sports there include football, track and field, handball 